Hey guys, what's up? KSK Royal here, and in this video, I will show you how to install a Pixel 3 ROM on any Android device. So basically, if you're a stock Android fanboy, especially a fond of Pixel experience, then this video will help you get a Pixel experience on your current Android device. Installing a Pixel 3 ROM on any Android device is very, very easy if you follow this video till to the end. So Pixel 3 ROM brings up all of the features of Pixel devices. You will get a brand new live wallpapers, a new redesign of Roboto font, as well as a material design too, a Pixel launcher and many more features. Pixel 3 ROM is also based on Android Pie, so which means you will get all of the Android Pie working features on your device. So this ROM is currently available as official. That means everything works fine except the Face ID. So if your device is compatible with a Face ID, you will not be able to use it. That being said, you can transform your Android device into a Pixel device by flashing this ROM. So are you ready for this? Without further wasting any time, let's get started. Alright, so before jumping up, the prerequisites of this video is uh, make sure you have an unlocked bootloader. Also, you need a TWRP record installed on your device, a custom record which will help you to install a Pixel 3 ROM onto your device. I will not be able to explain all of these things in this video. To know more about how to install a TWRP on your specific Android device, go to the XDA page and search for a specific Android device and follow the instructions from there. So once you are having an unlocked bootloader and TWRP record installer, then you're good to go. Then head over to this website from the link in the description of this video. Now from here you need to look for your device. For instance, a demonstration purpose of this video, I will be flashing a Pixel Experience ROM on my Poco F1. So I will go and select my device from here. Then I will choose the latest available ROM and download it. So once you're done downloading this ROM, then move this zip file to your either internal or external SD of your device. So I just want to say one thing, before flashing this ROM, please, please make sure you have to back up all of user data to your computer. So then head over to the recovery to do so. On my device, I will first gonna turn off my device, then holding power plus volume up for a few seconds on most of the Android devices will take you to the ATWRP custom recovery. From here, once you're inside the TWRP recovery, the first thing you should always do is backup the current existing ROM onto your SD card and move that backup to the computer to store safely. So this will help to restore a back to the current ROM just in case anything goes wrong. Once it's done backing up the ROM, now select the option called Wipe. Then from here, choose a Swipe to wipe the data. So once you're done, now go back to the main page and here you need to choose the option called install zip option and select the storage from here. In my case, I have copied the ROM to the pen drive, so I will choose the USB storage option. Now choose the Pixel ROM zip file from here and flash it. So this will take a couple of minutes and don't interrupt anything, sit back and relax. Also you don't need any Google apps, this ROM is bundled with all of the Pixel goodies also which comes with a built-in Google applications. So once it's done flashing the ROM, now choose the uh, wipe Delvi cache. And that's it. You have successfully installed a Pixel experience based on Android Pie on your device. So this ROM is working uh, super fine. So I have been using this for almost uh, one month as my daily driver. And I'm really feeling very happy about it. So start tinkering with your device. That's pretty much about it. Thanks for watching this video. This has been KSK so far. I'll catch you in my next one.